Okay, y'all, so welcome back. And quick update with the jail. I've been getting emails and text messages saying I've been getting packages delivered to the house like every day for the past week while I was at work. And the only thing I could think of was, yes, I have it all. So I think I do have everything. I started opening boxes prematurely. I should have waited, but here we go. Let's flip the camera around real quick. So I literally have new coils, new drop brackets, angle geometry brackets is what they're actually called, front and rear, a new oil pan, even a new transmission, which got delivered from LKQ off of eBay. It came from like someplace in Washington. So this thing looks good. It said, they said they only, it's only got 1,100 miles on there. Let's see if we can get it in there. It's somewhere on there. But yeah, uh, talking with them, those guys are awesome at LKQ. That's the old one. Still got to take the heater off, transfer case, get that all buttoned up. But yes, we've got EOS four and a half inch suspension. And then under those bad boys, which by the way, I got those for a really great deal. The guy put it on his truck for like two months, decided he didn't want it. And he went with a full coilover setup, front and rear. Don't know why he just didn't save the money that way the first place, but better for me. I picked those up off of like Facebook Marketplace for I want to say like 300 bucks, along with these Terraflex shock brackets, shock brackets, whatever the hell they're called, whatever they're called. Uh, yes, yeah, so I got front and rear for those, so I guess I'll be throwing those on along with all that. But yes, I've got all metal cloak stuff to look at that. Ooh, it's gonna look so good with the white. That's gonna look so good. And of course I've got all new metal cloak steering as well. Like I said, I started opening boxes, but I got way too excited. Let's see what's out of there. Sorry about the mess in the camera. Ugh, here it is. Oh, nope, that's tired. <laughs> In here, some place. Another tire rod. There we go. Oh, all new. Right. The tire rod? Whichever it's called. This is I did not open it. Oh no. Look at that. I want it all the finer parts for this thing. So like I said, all metal cloak stuff. Some people don't like it. Also in this little box, I got new transmission lines, transmission cooler lines and sorry about that. So yeah, like I said, the only thing left to do is put all of this on that. So, so within the week, I wanna say I wanna get Transmission put in, all that swapped over. Hopefully get all that bolted up. And hopefully I can get started on this lift, which is gonna be the fun part. Transmission is gonna be so annoying. Uh, and I think I got a couple more stuff coming in the mail. I wanna say I'm still missing some, some more steering parts. I wanna say I'm missing, not 100% sure. And then after all that's done, Hopefully I can get it to an alignment shop and possibly re-geared within the next couple of weeks. That is the plan whenever I get time off from work. But I've also got a wedding coming up. I gotta be a part of a groomsman and wedding. Uh, I'm going on a trip to Alaska in like two weeks. So that's gonna be fun. Hopefully I get some footage of that. Going out there, go fishing and you know, just have a great time. We got a buddy up that way. Go see him and his wife. Uh, and hopefully, get all this in get it all figured out and we shall see how it goes because i can't wait to drive that thing and i'm still trying to figure out a name for it and a color scheme my buddy said who was help, he helped me take the transmission out who was awesome by the way he showed up for my birthday which is like a week ago and completely surprised me and was like yeah man the only reason i came is to help you work on this truck and the worst part about it is the transmission showed up hours after he got on the plane and left. Had it shown up 
I don't know, day before or that day of him leaving, we probably would have thrown it in and had this thing moving and moving under its own power. So that sucked that we didn't get a chance to do that. But, you know, it is what it is. It happens. I'm not too sad about it. I already was planning on putting it in by myself. Maybe I might make my girlfriend help me. She could learn a thing or two. Or she could just get my way. Or this guy could help me. That is also my financial advisor. Ain't the right stitch. He, he, he approves of this whole truck process. So, yeah. Uh, so I guess we get started. Hopefully I can get some videos of what's going on and maybe record what's going on. But as we can tell, and as we all know, I'm horrible at keeping this thing rolling. So stay tuned. Run does not sound bad. Still lit up like a fucking Christmas tree.